What's up everybody, it's Grant, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the body roll with the bow. Baby, hit it. What's up everybody, it's Grant. Uh, so today, as I said, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the body roll with the bow. Now, similar to last week, I'd say this is like more of an advanced move, but it's like an early advanced move. Uh, so as I stated last week, if you guys saw that video, it's a move where it's a little bit more on the harder side, but it's not really that difficult to get used to or to get at first. Um, you should be able to get it here and there at least, and then uh, maybe get into the rhythm of getting it more as you practice it a decent amount. So if you watched last week's tutorial, the leading up into this move is going to be a little bit easier for you to get because it's the same way to build momentum, but if not, it's really not that hard to learn. Uh, you don't even have to watch the last video because I'm going to be explaining it again here. Uh, so basically, we're going to start out about three quarters of the way down your bow, or if you have grip, a little bit uh, further down past that grip. And we're just going to hold it in our right hand, and what we're going to do is we're going to just swing the bow all the way to the left, and then we're going to swing it all the way back around until it's behind our back, and this is on my left side of my body. So now at the same time that this happens, you're going to want to put your left hand behind your back on the other side. Now, in order to make this move easier for you, you really need to reach on each side because your hand needs to be out really far. Now, what I'm going to do from here is I'm just going to toss the bow from this side, rolling it over and catching it on the other side, and the bow is just going to roll 180 degrees to the other side. So now when you do this, you don't want to throw it just completely straight, even though that's kind of what it looks like it's doing. Uh, but the reasoning for that is because obviously gravity will pull it down. So if you throw it straight, it's a lot harder to catch it because the bow is going to drop and start to roll down below. So you kind of want to throw it up a little bit as well as throwing it um, across. So you're going to want to throw it instead of just straight across, throw it a little bit more up. But of course, don't throw it too high because then it's not going to work and it'll look kind of weird. Uh, so just a light toss over to the other side and we're just going to catch it in that hand. Now keeping in mind, my hand is really, really stretched out on both sides just to make it easier to catch. Um, you can move your body around a little bit, but don't like actually fully like twist your body and throw it to the side because that's not really going to work. Um, you can just kind of twist as it's coming over, as the bow's coming over to the other side just to ensure that you catch it on both sides. So that was just one side, and actually you can go back and forth, literally just catching it like this. Now this isn't really a move that's in a lot of katas, but it's kind of fun to do because you can basically do anything from here. If you guys have seen uh, previous tutorials, you know you can throw it up to your head and catch it behind your back and all kinds of stuff like that. Uh, but that's basically how to do this move. So again, just one more time, just so you guys fully understand it. About three quarters of the way down the bow, I'm holding it in my right hand. We're swinging it to one side, all the way around the other side until the bow is behind our back. And remember bringing this hand all the way to the other side. And we're just going to lightly toss, and not necessarily toss, actually it's more of a roll, because a toss would be actually, uh, the bow doesn't make contact with your body, but the entire time I'm doing this move, it's rolling on the front of my stomach area, and then catching it, and then again, obviously going back is the same thing with the other side. So right from here, it's just rolling on my body and catching it on the other side, same thing on the other side. So hopefully I explained this well enough. Again, it's it's not that hard to get this move, uh, but if you guys do have any questions, feel free to ask them. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys. Everybody like, hey, are you ready to go?